Hey everyone, Remy here from Capital Homes Realty and today we're gonna to be ranting, ranting about the condos. So I got a beef to pick with an article that I read where prices of condos in Ottawa have dropped 13%. It's just not true. Playing with averages is kind of dangerous because you really have to look into deeper detail and these articles are sending all this false information out uh, without actually maybe going to take a little bit of a history class. Okay, so details. Prices have dropped for condos in Ottawa by 13%. Um, but if anybody remembers, uh, maybe if we hit the rewind button. Oh, that's right. Last year in October, condo prices spiked over 7%, kind of odd for just one month. Taking a month to month approach and comparing it solely to the month prior of that year is kind of always a bad idea. October 2014, there were $6 million plus condos that sold that October, driving the average price of a condo up. What happened this year? zero million dollar condos sold in October 2015, driving the average price down. When we play with averages and we play with the top and bottom of these kind of situations, you're always gonna be left with an obscure number that is unrealistic. Now, don't get me wrong, the condo market in Ottawa is not all rainbows and unicorns. It's definitely um, it's definitely struggling, but the price, if you own a condo and you have a condo that's 400,000 or that's 300,000, your price did not just drop 13% this month. So what really pisses me off is that people take these headlines to heart and it, realtors included, realtors won't do the research, they won't even go back a year. Um, they'll just read the headline and they take that as law and then it becomes a widespread either panic or a parade of how prices rise and decline uh, month to month. So if we're just comparing this one article, that up there is the market and the guy on the ground are condos and the condos are getting beat up. But in reality, the condo market is slightly down and not preposterously down in prices. Um, there's so much data that can be pulled and you can make anything look any way you want it to and that's what these articles are doing. So if you're looking, if you're selling or looking to buy a condo, do your research, make sure whoever you're talking to knows what, what the hell they're talking about um, and then you're gonna be much more educated on the market. Don't just read the headlines and take it to heart. Um, you gotta look into the greater details. So until next time guys, take care.